And right now, new at 530, not everyone who tries out for basketball or cheerleading will get a spot on the school's team. And so we know this leaves a large portion of students unable to gain practice in teamwork and friendship and accountability that organized sports can bring. WCNC Charlotte Shamari Morrison shows us how one Charlotte educator, though, has created a safe space for girls who were overlooked. You can hear their stomps and their chants. Vibrate through any room. They are the steppers of distinction. You just get to bring all your energy from you become more relaxed. You get to bring all your energy onto that. Their captain, Kamari, is transformed from a timid eighth grader to a leader. Darren Ford, the founder of the program, is also a behavior modification tech at Northridge Middle School. Just being able to um, have that uh, opportunity for them, not just to go straight home in the neighborhoods, um, they stay after school and just be involved in something that's great. Data shows Northridge is a Title I school with a higher average number of students chronically absent and receiving suspensions. And I talked to him and get to the root of things. Why, you know, why are you sleeping in class? Um, so, you know, I stayed up late last night babysitting. And a lot of people don't realize that these students go through a lot outside of school. Uh, stepping so keeps right them though. engaged and it teaches them the historical significance of stepping in the black community, like at historically black colleges and universities. Listen, I, I'm all for any type of college as long as I get my degree, my education, I'm good. But HBCU is perfect. The life lessons learned in the studio of their middle school will teach them life lessons they'll take with them forever. Shamari Morrison, WCNC Show.